Hey guys, Kiss the Guy here, back with another episode of Medieval Engineers. And this time I'm going back to my roots and doing a castle recreation. This castle I'm recreating is a very old castle from England. It's called Bodium Castle or Bodium. I don't actually know how to say it correctly, so if someone does, let me know in the comments how to pronounce it or I'll just figure it out later. But it doesn't really matter to me because all that matters is that I recreate this castle. Now if you remember back in the day I did two other recreations, Bastille and Neuschwanstein, which I finished much more recently and you know I really enjoyed doing those castle recreations so I figured why not go back and do yet another recreation. I mean I enjoyed them so let's go for it. And if I remembered I should have a couple overlays of what I'm talking about, the castle I'm referring to, and a ground plan to give you an idea. As you can see, I've already laid out the ground plan, just to uh, save the trouble of doing that on video, because that's really probably the most tedious part of the whole process, is figuring out how you're gonna... what the footprint of the castle is going to be, and I conveniently... or I got lucky at least, and conveniently lined up the ground with the blocks perfectly, so we got that going for us. I don't know, I just think it looks nice. <laughs> It's worth noting, I guess. Anyway, so if you remember my other recreations, you know that this is certainly not an, going to be accurate. It's just going to be to the best of my interpretation. It's really... I don't know. It's, I'm doing it more for the enjoyment, and the castle's kind of just a loosely based inspiration of what I'm doing here. So let me get these windows how I, w how I would like them to be, and that's exactly how. So this is just going to be a wildly inaccurate interpretation of... Bodium Castle, but nonetheless, I think it'll be enjoyable to build. Unfortunately, there's no water in Medieval Engineers because this is actually surrounded by a large lake that I assume is artificial. But yeah, I figured I'd do another recreation. Um, I it's been a while since I did one, and I, to be honest, I really enjoyed them. Although Neuschwanstein was a huge challenge because it's so big and all those towers, man, that is really what kind of killed it the most for me. That thing is so big. Oh, I can't imagine doing another castle that size again for a while, to be totally honest with you guys. Although I may come back and do something else similar to that, but for now, it's kind of... Yeah, I'm not touching it for now. <laughs> and a couple people seem to think that I'm abandoning Medieval Engineers completely because of something I said in my review, but don't worry, I still plan on doing it. It's just I just pointed out that I kind of got bored of it then. Yeah, although I'm coming back with this, so I think this will keep me entertained for a while. They're building this recreation, at least. Okay, then I want this to jut out a bit, and then... Uh, how many is this? This is three, and it looks like the window is centered more towards the left. So we'll do it like this. You know, actually... Yeah, I think that's what I want. Is that what I want? Yeah, that's what I want right there. And... Okay, that looks like something, although I think the window is like this. No, I'm... Eh, it, shouldn't, it should be fine. I was just thinking the walls are going to be too thin to support it, but I don't think they will be, actually. Because there's actually a lot of um, walls that go like this, so that'll support the upper levels. And this thing's only like two or three stories high at the most, so that's good, I guess. And here comes the part where I start interpreting things my own way, and they... Or, you know, whatever. Or I'm diverting from probably the realistic castle quite a bit already, but... Man, this thing is going to be huge! Look at it! Look at how big this is! This might be bigger than Bastille. I think it will be, actually. Overall, especially if I get around to doing the inner floors and whatnot. And there's no sign. That's probably going to remain to be the biggest castle I've ever built for quite a while, unless this thing takes the crown, but I really don't think it will. Alright, I think I'd like to start work on the front entrance now. That is probably what I'm going to do. I'm going to build that up and get a good look at it. Okay. Let me think about this for a second. Alright, I actually took that as an opportunity to take a drink of water because my throat's been... I don't know, it's either allergies or a cold. I want to think it's a cold because I take an allergy pill, but if it's allergies, that sucks. Fucking hate allergies with a passion. Okay, dokie. I say okay a lot, and I notice that. It bugs me when I say that. But it's just, uh, I guess, an idiosyncrasy of my personality. Uh, okay, one, two, three. 
And then we're going to have a... Eh. And then another blank slot. Blank slot. Let's call it a blank slot, although it's not a blank slot. It's just a blank block, I guess. And are there windows on the interior of this thing? It doesn't... Um, doesn't appear so. I could be wrong, because I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm going to assume there isn't. For now, at least. Okay, and we're just gonna kind of do this to get a rough layout of the interior. Okay, and that's actually rather simple, isn't it? Um. Okay, so that's basically laid out, and I guess I need to finish that more completely, huh? That would make sense. I may add some more windows here if it looks kind of barren. But for now, we're going to pretend it doesn't need them. And just do this. And hope that it doesn't collapse. Come on. There we go. Looking good. Almost. And that's basically... The basic, basic layout is all done on this. Let's have a look at the structural integrity view. Looks perfectly fine to me. Nothing's collapsing. Look at all this other stuff I built. Interesting. A good flashback of my, what, three, four month YouTube career so far. Very exciting. Actually, I think it's more like five months. I started in January around this time. Huh. Fun fact. That's fun. And it's a fact. Okay. Okay, Kessler, you're getting a little rambly here, but then again, that's who you are. Alright, so this next part I'm going to do the inner tower. I'm going to try to do the inner tower. I'm looking at how they did it, and trying to get an idea of what I'd like to do for it. I think I know exactly what I want to do. The question is, will it look okay or not? Well, there's only one way to find out, I suppose, and we're about to find out. Come on, why are you not dragging? Then how high do you... Uh, might want to go one lower. No, that'll be perfect, actually. Executive decisions going on here. Deciding at the last minute how I would like everything to be. There's no other way to do it, I suppose. At least in my opinion. Okay, you need to attach this fucking wall, you piece of shit. Oh my god, I hate these blocks sometimes. Uh, let's do it like this then. What if I... Can I trick it? Like that? Nope, it's gonna be a little bitch. Okay, whatever. Be frustrating as fuck. And then seven. Now I can place it there. Boom. I wish there was a good block to connect those two, but there really isn't that I'm aware of. I'll look into that later. But then there's going to be an inner um, support structure kind of thing. Or it's just going to be a doorway, really. It's going to be using the stone wall, or the stone block arch, I guess. Nope, not like that, actually. We're gonna do it like this. So the entrance is gonna be much more narrow than what I wanted it to be, but I guess I have no choice, really. Come on, let me place this block on top of those blocks, you son of a bitch. I just wanna place a block on top of it. Uh, two. Why are you doing this to me? Come on, video game, you son of a bitch. Uh, make me do it the most fucking complicated way possible. Thank you. There we go. Okay. And what are we going to do here? Well, Kessler, this is what we're going to do. We're going to patch it up somehow. We might actually want to use st thick stone blocks, because this is the front entrance, after all, and this castle, I believe, isn't a, an ornamental castle like Neuschwanstein. It's more of a defensive structure, like most castles, I suppose. So you probably want a nice, sturdy, strong wall. Just a thought, though. You know what we need? We need a staircase of some kind that can access the upper floors. Uh, that would be a good idea. Why don't we do that now, and then we'll probably wrap up this episode. So I'd like these to be relatively short. I don't want them to be too long. There we go. Fantastic. Oh, it's so beautiful. I'm in love with this castle. 
I actually think this is going to look pretty cool, to be honest. It's a... Uh, it's really quite an impressive castle. Excellent. It all works out in the end for me. It looks like they really tweaked the lighting on this game. It actually gets dark in dark places, like light doesn't penetrate as much, so that's pretty cool, I guess. Okay, we got this staircase going on here. Actually, you know what I'd like to do? Uh, we're going to clear this toolbar out. And I do need a floor piece. I wish they had stone floors that weren't giant thick blocks like this. That would just make me so happy. Ah, oh, well, one day, I suppose. Or maybe never. Okay, that's our basic entrance right there. And we might as well just cover this all with fucking wood. Doesn't look the greatest, but it's something. Uh, I hope this doesn't look bad. I mean, it doesn't collapse, more importantly. Oof, that doesn't look like a real thing, but it's not falling, so I'll leave it be for now. Why are you getting so dark? Stop it. Look at the sun. Will that brighten my world? Okay, let me have a look from the ground see how that looks. It looks okay! Let me actually readjust the sun and get a better view of this. Because I am God and I can see anything I want to see. Excellent, I can move the sun is what I meant to say there. Okay, so this looks okay, although it's kind of disappointing how that ended up. You know what I could do? You know what, we're going to fix that right now. Uh, not with that block though. Seven, we are going to remove this block. And we're going to remove this block. We're going to move it down one. We're going to move this here. And then we're just going to fill it in. You know, we'll do a hollow block so it's not uh, as heavy. There we go. I'm a genius. I should be a real engineer. Look at that. That does not look bad at all. I'm actually pretty happy with how that came out. And actually, there appears to be a window up on one of these upper levels here. Um, how am I going to do that? Well, probably like this. <laughs> there we go, although that kind of defeats the purpose of having thick stone walls here, but whatever. We'll, we'll deal with any problems as they come, or arise. Now it's fucking dark back here. Let's move this on somewhere less stupid. There we go. Well, it's less stupid in this position. Okay. Um, I'm pretty happy with how uh, it's coming out so far. Of course, let me know in the comments what you think of what I've come with, come up with thus far. And let me know if you are enjoying me recreating this castle. And yes, it does sound like I'm doing an outro because I am kind of ending this episode now. So that's all for now. Uh, be sure to slap a like and subscribe. Mostly a like on this video and a subscribe on my channel if you haven't subscribed already to my awesome content. I'm trying to get back into daily Let's Plays and weekly uh, review videos, so stay tuned for that. Be sure to subscribe, and you'll know if I succeed or fail. Hopefully I succeed, and I get 10 billion subscribers by the end of the year. Probably won't, though, but we'll see. We can't get to 10 billion without your subscription, so be sure to hit that subscribe button and become a part of the greatest community on YouTube. Oh, what else do I put in my intros? I don't know. Or, not intros, outros. Um, leave a comment and say whether or not you think this castle is fucking awesome. And, yep, that sounds like words, alright. So, let's go ahead and end this episode, and I will say goodbye. My name is Custer the Guy, and I will see you guys next time. Goodbye!